Hi, I'm Dr. Joel Schlesinger. Thanks for visiting with us today. As a dermatologist, I'm frequently asked about birthmarks. Now, birthmarks are a very large group of items that comprise things such as moles, things like a port wine stain, and also other things that may appear at birth and disappear or grow larger over time. When I look at a birthmark in a child, I'll look at many of them that might be, for example, a patch around the forehead or on the back of the neck, and that may be just a very early collection of blood vessels that may disappear over time called a nevus flamius. Now, nevus flamius, or the types of growths that are like that, disappear, but we also have growths that can actually appear as a child is growing and in the first year of life become quite large, such as a hemangioma. Now, infantile hemangiomas generally grow from the time that an infant is born or shortly after that and reach their full size at around one year of age and gradually involute or go away over the first seven or eight years of life. The rule of thumb is that it grows until a child is one year of age and then another 10% goes away each year. So at five years, 50% of them would, would be gone in about seven years, 70%, et cetera. Moles generally do appear as we grow older, but sometimes we have moles that children are born with, and those are known as congenital nevi. Now, congenital nevi are sometimes ones that we are concerned about, and sometimes they do need to be removed. Lastly, there are certain birthmarks, such as port wine stains, that are very large uh, vessels that are on the face in a distribution such that it's involving one half or a, most of that half of the child's face. And those can be treated with lasers such as pulse dye lasers or intense pulse light devices. And we often find that those respond over time and they can also be treated very effectively. So there's a lot of difference between what is a birthmark and what people consider a birthmark. So I'm glad that we had this time to discuss it and I hope that it was illuminating. Thank you for joining me today.